Have you ever wondered how the spectacular yet terrifying eruptions of volcanoes occur? This is a question that has fascinated humans for millennia. Volcanoes, these incredible geological phenomena, are formed when molten rock, or magma, is forced to the Earth's surface through a vent. There are three main types of volcanoes, shield, cinder cone, and stratovolcanoes. Shield volcanoes like those in Hawaii are broad and flat, with lava flowing out smoothly. Cinder cone volcanoes on the other hand are steep and circular formed by explosive eruptions. Stratovolcanoes like Mount Fuji in Japan are the most common and potentially the most deadly, formed by layers of hardened lava, tephra, pumice, and volcanic ash. The process of volcanic eruptions involves a complex interplay between magma and the Earth's crust. As pressure builds up underneath the crust, magma is forced upwards, causing the ground to crack and eventually erupt. Now that we have a basic understanding of what volcanoes are and how they form, let's delve deeper into the world of volcanoes. What makes certain areas of our planet more prone to volcanic activity than others? This is a question that has fascinated geologists for centuries. The answer lies in the Earth's tectonic plates, the massive slabs of the Earth's crust that float atop the semi-fluid mantle. Where these plates converge, diverge, or slide past each other, magma from the mantle can reach the surface, resulting in volcanic activity. But it's not just plate boundaries that are volcanic hotspots. Certain areas, like Hawaii, are located above mantle plumes, areas where hot magma rises from deep within the Earth. These plumes create a chain of volcanoes as the tectonic plate moves over them. Some of the most well-known volcanic regions include the Ring of Fire, an area that spans the circumference of the Pacific Ocean and is home to 75% of the world's active volcanoes, and Hawaii, known for its shield volcanoes. Volcanoes are not randomly distributed over the Earth's surface but are found mostly in certain areas due to the Earth's tectonic architecture. So, what have we learned about these fascinating and formidable natural phenomena? Volcanoes, these awe-inspiring giants, are more than just a spectacle of nature. They are a testament to the dynamic and ever-changing nature of our planet. They are formed when molten rock or magma finds its way to the Earth's surface, creating a vent or opening. This process is driven by the movement and collision of the Earth's tectonic plates. Volcanoes are not randomly scattered across the globe, but are most likely to occur in specific areas known as volcanic hotspots. These are often found along the boundaries of tectonic plates, such as the famous Pacific Ring of Fire. Understanding these patterns and the processes that drive volcanic activity are crucial in predicting and preparing for volcanic eruptions. Remember, while volcanoes may be a source of awe and wonder, they also remind us of the dynamic and constantly changing nature of our planet.